Hey guys, it's Tamer Laya Pluridon for BattlePetRoundup.com and I am on PTR once again. I'm fighting Jufu, Club of Juen. Um, he is currently dead because I used him doing something else. But uh, I'm going in here to show you his abilities because Spirit Claws is kind of strange. It hits really hard. It has an 80% hit chance, but it always hits when the weather is moonlight. And then he has Moonfire. So I think you can uh, see where we're going here. You have to have some kind of uh, weather effect. Uh, I like call it lightning because he's a beast. And I mean, like, he's a beast. But he's also, you know, a beast. -er. Anyway. Uh, <laughs> uh, so I go with the Tranquil Mechanical Yeti. Um, there are a couple others. I may have already blown them <laughs> on other things as well. Uh, so I, with the Yeti, I'm going with Ion Cannon just because I can kind of anticipate when he's going to bite it. And I can use the Ion Cannon and front load a whole bunch, bunch of damage. Um, we have the Clockwork Rocket Bot with Toxic Smoke and Batter to make full use of the Call Lightning's extra hits. And uh, Sticky Grenade. And then we have the Mechanical Panda and Dragon Lang with Flyby, Bombing Run, and Decoy. Did I mean to do Flyby? Yes, I did. Um... I'm going with the Mechanical Panda and Dragonling over the Zeppelin because all my Zeppelins are currently dead. <laughs> so, yes, it's been kind of a rough night. Um, start the fight. Uh, you can see Jufu has 296 speed, which isn't particularly fast, but it ends up being faster than most Mechanicals. Um, there's uh, Son of Animus is a cool ability where he'll stun you if he goes first but he's very slow compared to Jufu. Uh, Jufu has the boss buff which reduces all damage taken by 50%. Boss bets cannot be dealt more than 35% of their maximum health in one attack. So uh, that's why I'm kind of like ah, I want to use the ion cannon but I don't really want to use the ion cannon because even with a 50% it's going to hit harder than that. Uh, and he's just going to absorb the extra damage that I deal. It's awesome. Oh, and the other, the last ability that Jufu has is uh, Feed, which deals damage and heals him. But it's a lot of damage and it heals him for a lot. So, yeah. So the first thing he's going to do is cast Move Fire. But it's not going to hurt me too, too bad because I'm mechanical. Um, and then I'll smack him a little bit with my fist. Um, and then I'm probably gonna die next round, even with the lightning. So I'll cast Ion Cannon. Um, cause I'm gonna res, cause I'm a mechanical. He just fed on me, so... And now I have to just die, cause... That's how Ion Cannon works. And you just saw the little extra doohickey for the buff. Um, and now we're getting to the rocket bot. We'll do smoke and then batter. Unless he, you know, crits me for 11 billion. Um, I would rather get the grenade on there than just hit batter, but... Yeah. <laughs> Juwen's kind of difficult. Um, and we'll cast the decoy. He's probably going to feed on me right now. I don't know. Well, that's the tricky thing about Spirit Claws is that Spirit Claws hits 80%. So, I mean, it still hits pretty hard, but it doesn't hit as hard as maybe it could. As often as it could. Um, and that's part of why I like using the decoy, because we just dodged his feed. Um, and the reason that's the reason I went with the flyby is because, uh, yeah, because now all my bonds and stuff hit harder. I'm mechanical, so I res, and then I kill him. Hooray! Um, 
Honestly, in live, I'm probably going to use the Howl Bomb with Chromenius and all that. Uh, but you can kind of pull together a good strategy to beat Juvo, hopefully, uh, in the Celestial Tournament. Um, if this video is helpful, please thumb up and subscribe. There are links in the comments below. The description below if you need links to the blog or my twitter or my facebook or my i don't even know what else there is there's so many links um i hope this helped and uh, i'll see you next time